not so Freudian here. Welcome back to let's or well welcome to uh, let's play Magic the Gathering Arena. It is now an open beta. I did some in the closed beta as well. Um, but yeah, I started the game up and it kicked me into a tutorial. This, he said, blah, 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 the forest belongs to the elves, the little wisp that's probably going to be giving me advice said, oh, she seems like a helpful teacher. Oh, there's the wisp. It goes over here when it talks, I guess. I don't know. Drop a land. Yeah. Can I? Yeah, I don't know if you've... I can skip the tutorial, but for people who haven't seen... Uh, yes, I'm done with Isaac for now. I just do the daily for the day, usually. You can summon creatures to fight for you. Yeah, basically doing the tutorial in case people don't know anything about magic. Play a land, play another creature. I wish I could just, like, skip through the... Okay, see you later, Shark Human. I streamed later today than I usually do. Just because I, uh... had to do a bunch of updates on my computer. You're going to pay for that. Blah, 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 stupid elves. Creatures on tap. Play that because I don't have, you know, nothing else to do. I'm gonna lose one as it blocks, you know, power toughness. Left side's power, right side's toughness, as you can see with the little sword and shield icons. Oh, I guess they're going to explain every step of it. I have to crush you. Then I probably that beast will destroy your creatures if you attack now. So was it gonna say not to attack or I was going to say, I, it's a tutorial, so either he's going to attack so he won't have anyone to block, or I'm going to draw removal of some sort. Or he could have killed me because he played a not great pump ability. Yeah. Yeah, since he doesn't have trample, he just wastes all the damage on that. Oh, it's a sorcery, no wonder. Yeah, that's a terrible card. Giant growth is an instant for one man instead of two. Yeah. So now I take vengeance on that. That's, that's a very black card. I don't know why it's in white. Like, that's basically assassinate, isn't it? We've got you cornered. Cast the spell. Uh, tap all creatures. Yeah. yeah, I'm pretty sure the card assassinate from back in the day was exactly that. Hey, lip boy. And finish it off. Yay. Alright, so basically you want to get your opponent's life down to zero. If you attack with a creature, you can't block with the creature that next turn unless it has an ability called Vigilance. Yeah, I get a terrible card. Yeah, good work back there. Blah, blah, blah. I'm probably going to learn about instants now, right? Mirbo? Surprise attack! And I have the same card I did last, or the same hand I did last time. Weird. Oh, haste. 
this is about creature abilities thing. I don't know. It's kind of yes. weird. For all the uh, duels of the Planeswalkers games, they, they like labeled the tutorials by These things are basically what they're harmless. specifically teaching you. Okay, more goblins. Okay, maybe worry just a little. Yeah, nice thing is your creatures heal at the end of the turn, so I can just block his one ones forever. You need to mount a defense. I'm gonna take two more damage. The next turn I'll take no damage unless he drops something like that. <laughs> I've got more where that came from. Yeah. Creatures heal at the end of the turn, which is what I said. Okay, I can drop the cat and the keeper now, so I have three white mana available. These creatures aren't tough enough to survive being blocked. Hold them back. Okay, no attackers. Everybody but me. Charge! Tuh. It's one of my favorite, like flavor texts off the. Uh, Hard. Hey, nobody kills my troops but me. I think that might be as well. But Ib Halfheart Goblin Tactician is his uh Yeah, there we go. Has the uh cards don't have flavor text on here, I guess. But yeah. He's a tactician because he's smart enough not to charge with everyone else. Oh, here it is. Oh, expecting dragon fodder. Okay. Oh no, he has, you know, a creature that'll die when I block, and then two more of the grunts that don't block. I gain health for playing that, and yeah. If I had attacked, he could have doubled up on one and killed it, then killed the other one. I still would have been. Yeah, the uh, never walk barefoot in a goblin warren is just some, you know, poor isle scat humor, basically. It's time to bring the pain. Just three damage to each creature. Oh, to each player. Oh. Okay. That's not gonna... Then I guess I have to hit no attackers. He does have tramples, so it doesn't matter how strong he is as long as I block and nothing happens. I don't even need to use this. I just take them down. It's the pokey that hurt the most. I wonder if those were all flavor just flavor text off random goblin cards, because that would be kinda hilarious. Philic like Ward Knight's Pledge. Okay, now we learn about auras. Basically an aura has to target a creature. If it is wisdom you seek, I will teach you. Do, 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 do. Birds fly freely, unfettered by earthly bonds. Is he just going to be spouting ice cream cones? Everything is connected. You must understand the air, land, just and cones. Sea. Like they're kind of trite, but I guess they do, you know, kind of make sense. That bird can fly over any blockers on the ground. 
so I just need to draw Take Vengeance. Because since it's an aura, if I kill the creature it's on, it goes away. Or the aura goes away as well. But yeah. Good. You've been paying attention. Uh, probably because if you type that into Google, the uh, police tend to, or the FBI, ATF, somebody tends to want to interview you about it. Obstacles may block your path, but do not lose sight of your true goal. Has there ever been a crab that used oh, a skull as a shell? Little hat. So cute. <laughs> Sorry. Continue. Yeah, no point in attacking because it'll just block it and nothing will happen. Battles ebb and flow. Yeah, so that's, uh, you know, gonna keep my creature from doing anything. But now I can just drop this on him. Then he will kill the crab if the crab blocks. Well, I'll watch the news and see if they've got, you know, a story about you getting arrested. If you keep to the shallows, you'll never learn the secrets of the depths. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. That sounds... deep. Gain the health. Then start smacking with that. Yeah, no police call time is going to be that quick. So if I attack with this, neither thing is gonna... Oh, now that this has flying. But yeah, they would, it would've just blocked and nothing would've happened. But now, I just don't do it. I just ignore him, basically. And now because it's a tutorial, they're both going to attack instead of this staying back to block. I just do this so nothing happens. The student is a river. The teacher is an ocean. Well, good luck in prison. The master is also an ocean. Wait, what? That last one sounds a bit fishy. Because he's a merfolk. Ha ha ha. You know what? The mystic I was thinking of isn't even a merfolk. Yeah. It was fun while they blasted. Yes, you can get the other inmates to subscribe to my channel. Okay, now we're learning about instance. Instance can be used a lot more often than the other stuff. So I can do them on the opponent's turn, for example. Your last lesson. Let's head to talk here. Learn the art of surprise. Viper Nang. Watch her every move and be ready for anything. Well, seeing as I don't have any, you know, instance of my own, and it's just a straight. Oh. One, two, cost. There's nothing else for me to do, really. Yeah, do something to the cat. It's not gonna, you know, be much of a problem, honestly. You know, it's a one-mana creature that isn't very good. No abilities. One power. This is my Now see, in a real game, you would target this at the creature that, with the higher attack. 
instead of the one with one power. But, you know, tutorial. I mean, trading, you know, one creature for one of her cards every turn is, you know, perfectly acceptable. The problem is here, now if she kills this creature, I lose, a, like, I'm down a card, because it took one of hers to get rid of two of mine. Okay, and what she did there, she dropped a creature to block, so my creature's blocked, which means it's not going to do damage to her. And then she sacrificed it using this card in order to draw two more. So she basically just, you know, used zero cards to, you know, have nothing happen there. Okay. Okay. Careful. You can't afford to take another hit yeah, like that. Can't attack, so no attackers. Lock first. She's going to attack. I'm going to make my dude bigger. I have to walk for it. Cast it now. This instant and flash just mean you can do it whenever. So now I survived. Reason to make that bigger unless she drops three of them. Uh, two of them. That's math for you. I think they changed the animations a little since the closed beta. Mm, I've got nothing, really. I'm at your mercy. You say that all the time. If only if a creature's attacking me. Looks like you've let your guard down. Now she drops something with flash and thinks she can attack me with it to kill me this turn, probably. Yeah. But also, you can only have four of each card in your deck, so that's illegal anyway. Yeah, instant drops me some defenders, then I just... I don't actually need to block one of them. Because the other two, I, uh... Now I kill her this turn. Yeah. Guess it would have worked anyway. I'll be in touch. So one thing new players don't think about magic is how it's, uh, your life is just another resource. As it doesn't matter if you're only a one life, as long as your opponent's at zero. So you don't need to, like, just keep yourself safe at all costs if it's going to cost you creatures or cards. After I annihilated you, I really didn't expect to see you. I was wondering if he turned into a Pokemon. This is a terrible idea. There's no way you're prepared for this guy. Yes. Yeah. It's a tutorial. I'm going to be prepared for this guy. I'll make a deal with you, Planeswalker. Defeat me. And I'll let you go. Lose, Isn't and you will serve that kind of how it works? Me. If I beat him, I get to leave? Because, like, at that point, it's he, like I've shown that he can't keep hold of me. Sometimes you need to make a tough decision. Did he 
he just throw away a dragon? Yeah, he's probably gonna use, um... I do as I choose with what is mine. A, uh... Resurrect, or... Reanimate, or something, to bring it back. Yeah. Everything here exists or perishes at my whim. Okay, I can't block it with... I was thinking save tactical advantage, but I wasn't thinking about uh, being able to fly or not. Oh, well. This will let me get some damage in. Because I'll block and then be able to attack with the line breaker. This isn't quite going to be able to survive. For some reason I was thinking he was 4-4, four, four, not 3-4. Oh, he also doesn't fly. It's a spirit, it should be... F it should fly. Yeah. Okay, so my creatures take 4 damage total. Not unexpected. So this guy's gonna let me start chaining creatures into life and cards, unless he kills it. Okay. My triumph is at hand. Yeah. Here I get three cards, three life, and I get to uh, like I won't take any damage. What? Yeah, this is the stack. It shows abilities and spells that are waiting to resolve. I underestimated you. Okay. Block. I'm actually an idiot because I should have double blocked the dragon here and then killed it by using tactical advantage. So I'm paying attention to what cards I got. Such impudence. Oh hey. There we go. Yeah. Let's see I could block and kill that by using two of these. Or, well, uh, I'm gonna just block that and then kill it but survive. And then just block that and die the next turn. Or block it. Okay. 
We've come this far. Don't give up now. Just gotta be able to block. Let's finish it. Cruel ultimatum would be hilarious right now. It's like, yeah, no matter how good you think you are, you can't win every game. Or something along those lines. Okay, so you can block and kill the demon here. He'll still die, but whatever. The angel blocks and wins because it's good. Well, it's really high stats now. It can also attack without um, tapping because it has vigilance, which I had forgotten about last turn. He had something with flash and flying to block the angel with. Alright. So now I gained something. It's like a Navi with an even more annoying voice. Okay, starter decks. Tactical Assault, Arcane Inventions, Graveyard Bash. Right, it's fire, force, and light. Okay. Pick one. It won't affect your games, and you can change it whenever All you right, want. Alright, so we have Ajani, Chandra, Gideon, Jace, Nissa, Liliana, Karn, uh, Jaya, Ballard, I think. She aged Sarkin to Fairy. Oh, that's Tezzeret, and then I don't know her name. She just came out in the most uh, M19, and I haven't gotten any of that. Uh, let's I go with Karn. Oh, hey. There we go. Vivian Reed. Okay. Bring your deck. If you complete it, you'll get a reward. Okay. Alright, I'm going to call that it for this video. I'm going to... I'll come on and do another video afterward. This one was just a half hour tutorial, so I'll split it off just so people can skip the tutorial video if they want. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe if you would. I'll see you guys next time.